What's up guys, I am the Lumberjig, the GSW Money in the Bank winner, and I am here to give you another episode of Get Chopped. Today I want to talk about the XFL. For those of you who wonder what the hell the XFL was, I'll give you a brief rundown. The XFL was the brainchild of the mad genius Vince McMahon and NBC's Dick Ebersol. It was the edgier, grittier version of professional football. This league had teams with the names Hitman, Maniacs with an X, Rage. You get the point. It's definitely supposed to be the alternative to the NFL. At the time, WWE was at the height of its popularity with the Attitude Era still in full swing. So the idea was simple. Bring the brashness of WWE's Attitude Era to football. And while that sounded great to Vince and NBC, it just didn't work out. The XFL was a disaster. For more on that, you should check out the great 30 for 30, This Was the XFL. Many of us thought the XFL was dead and gone, but alas, there's rumblings that Vinnie Mac's Football League might just make a comeback. Towards the end of last year, it was reported that Vince was taking money investing in a separate entity called Alpha Entertainment. It's an investment that goes across entertainment and sports. Could Vince really be considering bringing back one of the biggest disasters in sports history? Probably. Remember how I said before that Vince was a mad genius? It's true. This is the guy that took all the wrestling territories and bought them up and united them under the World Wrestling Federation. So, I mean, this guy is an innovator. He's not stupid. Plus, the Alpha Entertainment investment is completely separate from WWE. It's coming from his own money. So, of course, I think he could pull this stunt again. I mean, after all, he did say this. Do you ever have any thoughts about trying again? Yes, I do. I don't know what it would be. I don't know if it was going to be another XFL or what it may be or how different I would make it. It seems like uh, in some way it would tie in either with the NFL itself or the owners. If Vince really wanted to do this, now would be the time. The NFL ratings are down due to the anthem protests. Granted, the NFL still has great ratings, better than most TV, but I'm just saying they are down. Thanks to Donald Trump, the NFL is reaching even more backlash. And what does the world need now? An edgier football game. CTE be damned. I mean, if Vince really wanted to, he could do what he does with WWE all the time. Pump out the patriotism, do things like support the troops, but with the XFL. This is a great opportunity to try something different if Vince would want to revive the XFL. I guess the issue is, does Vince go back to the style of XFL that it happened in the early 2000s, or do you adapt and make a more PG product like current WWE? Does the XFL tone down its violence? I think it'd be hard not to do with CTE and concussion protocol. Then again, Vince isn't a stranger to controversy. Whether he chooses to revive the XFL or not, there's no denying that there's still interest in this odd, weird venture that he took with Dick Eppersall way back in 2001. So there's still interest there. Maybe he could try something different with Alpha Entertainment. I just don't know and I just don't think that the XFL coming back is the right call. What do you guys think? Am I right? Should the XFL just be done and never come back? Or should Vince McMahon actually try and get another go at this? Uh, let me know in the comments below. Like, comment, subscribe, follow us on Twitter at GetSlamPod. Like our Facebook page, Get Slammed. And uh, follow me if you'd like at Alumberjake. And remember, most of all, don't get Chapped.